Okay, dear experts, I just bought a new car. Oh, cars are my specialty. Oh, I'll say. Oh, I'll say. I'll tell you what. There's nothing the Dougie here doesn't know about cars. Oh, okay, excellent. That's going to make this question so perfect then. Okay, it says, uh, my new car has an electronic ignition and computer-controlled fuel injection. I was wondering, what is the importance of Boolean logic and computer programming? <laughs> excellent question. Uh, Dougie? What? <laughs> You want to field that question? Was there actually a question in there, Rick? Oh, yeah. That was the importance of Boolean logic in computers. You know, I mean, like the theorems and logical propositions and, uh, and or gates, uh, set theory, you know. Oh, we took all this in algebra. <laughs> <coughs> well, uh, <coughs> you know, that is a dandy uh, question. And, uh... But, you know, I can't answer it because they didn't really mention what make a car it was they bought. <laughs> well, let's just say it was a Ford product. <clears throat> uh, okay, uh, a Ford uh, product. Well, uh, of course, your Boolean logic is uh, less important in your Ford than, say, uh, uh, your GM product, uh, maybe a little bit more important than a Chrysler. Now, <clears throat> your domestic Boolean logic, by and large, is not quite as fancy, uh, intricate, or convoluted as your uh, imported uh, Boolean uh, logic. <coughs> but, uh, you know, if you were to, to have like a, a, like a set theory uh, break down, uh, of course, it'd be a lot easier to get your and or gates or your or and gates or your and or uh, maybe gates. Oh, geez. <laughs> and you know, Lord knows if you're if you're intending on on rebuilding a domestic uh, theorem, it's going to be a lot easier than one of those uh, flimsy uh, imported jobs. I'll tell you that. <laughs>